Hey guys, I'm back and today I am going to do a new look for you and it's a smoky black eye look and let's get started. So first I'm taking my NARS foundation which I really like in the color Aruba. Right, so I am done with my foundation. Now on to concealer. And I'm using the NARS concealer in the color Sucre d'Orge. And this concealer goes really well with the foundation color I'm using, Aruba. All right, next up is powder, and I'm using the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder in the color Translucent, and I'm using this Morphe brush for it, blending brush, uh, and this way I can put the powder on more precise. So I'm putting it under my eyes, on my forehead, and on my chin. All right, I'm done with the powder. Um, now, we're going to contour the nose. And I'm using this bronzer. I don't know where I bought it. It's really old. But hey, it works. And what I'm doing is the sides of my nose. With the bronzer, the tip, the sides, and in the middle, like that. So now I'm going to blend it out with my beauty blender where I still have some foundation on. Like that. All right, now we're going to do the eyebrows and I'm letting my eyebrows grow out because I want them to be thicker. Right now they're really thin. So for the eyebrows, I'm using the Anastasia Brow Freeze. And I'm using this um, for the brow freeze. So I'm now using this middle part of the brush to flatten it so it sticks better to my skin the hairs all right now i am filling in my brows with the mac shade brow tint in the color stud Okay, so I filled in my brows. And now I am just blending the color out with the same brush. Now I want to take my concealer brush to the other side and just create a line underneath my brow. And just blend it out with my finger. All right, I'm done with my brows. 
And now we're going on to the eyes. And for this, I'm using the Anastasia palette. And I'm going to use um, these two colors, Hugo and BK. And I'm creating a thick wing like this. All right, now I'm using the brown color, which I showed you, Hugo, this one. And I'm going to put that on top of the black color and just blend these two colors out. All right, now let's blend these two colors out. All right, now that we blended out those colors, I want to sharpen uh, this line. So I'm using my Beauty Blender again. All right, so now I am taking this liquid eyeliner from Essence. And then I want to create a thick, short wing. And we're just following our eyeshadow shape. Just the short wing. Okay, now we are using the same colors underneath our eyes, starting with the black. I'm using the black on the outer parts and then the brown color on the inner parts of my eye. Now blending it out. And now I'm going to line my waterline with this black color. And it's okay if you have a little bit of fallout from the eyeshadow under your eyes. That gives it a little bit of a vampy look, and I like that look. Okay, so now that's done. We're going to do the lashes. And I'm using the Lulu Lashes in the Sound Miami. All right, now that we have the lashes on, we are going to do the rest of the face. Starting with blush, and I'm just going to use a pinky color for this. Just to give the face a little bit more color. And now I'm going to use uh, the bronzer I used for my nose contour. <laughs> A 
I'm using my Beauty Blender to blend the blush a little bit out. And now on to the lips. So I am using the MAC lip liner in the color Stripped Down. And for the lips, I'm using the Urban Decay Stark Naked Lipstick. And just to make the lips a little bit more darker, I am using the MAC Lipstick in Velvet Teddy. Because I think it's a little bit too light for this look. And these lipsticks are glossy, so I don't think I'm going to use a lip gloss on top. I think we're done. So yeah, um, this is my second video that I made and um, subscribe, like, and comment. Ask me anything. Maybe I'll answer. Yeah, probably I'll answer um, because I like talking to you. And next time, I want to create a new look for you. I will see you next time. Bye, guys.